a UK nurse had sex with a dialysis patient in his car, then failed to get help when he died of a heart attack, according to a disciplinary hearing that booted her from the profession. Penelope Williams, 42, was found with a long-term patient after he died in the back of his car with his trousers down, according to The Telegraph. She initially told cops in Wales that she only met the man, who was not identified, because he messaged her to say he was feeling unwell. In a formal meeting with her managers, Williams, who had another partner, denied any sexual relationship with the now-dead man and said she merely sat in the back of his car for about 30 to 45 minutes while just talking. She further explained that, the patient, started groaning and suddenly died, according to a hearing of the Nursing and Midwifery Council, NMC. However, the nurse later admitted that they had actually been having a year-long affair while he was getting regular treatment, and met that night for sex. The NMC initially said the rob took place in a hospital car park, but on Wednesday apologized to the hospital, saying it actually happened in an unconnected car park in Wrexham. When her lover keeled over, Williams called a colleague instead of emergency services, Wales Online also reported. Williams was crying and distressed and asking for help as she tried to explain that someone had died, but still refused to call 999, the UK equivalent of 911, even when her pal begged her to, the report said. Instead, she waited for the colleague, who finally called for an ambulance when she got there, according to the reports, which did not detail how long it likely delayed him getting help. Once there, the pal also started her own doomed life-saving attempts on William's half-naked secret lover. The patient's death was listed as being from heart failure and chronic kidney disease triggered by a medical episode. The NMC struck off Williams, meaning she can no longer work as a nurse, for having brought the nursing profession into disrepute. Mrs. Williams' actions were significant departures from the standards expected of a registered nurse, and are fundamentally incompatible with her remaining on the register, the board ruled. The panel was of the view that the findings in this particular case demonstrate that Mrs. Williams' actions were so serious that to allow her to continue practicing would undermine public confidence in the profession and in the NMC as a regulatory body.